Hello, hello. Hi, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, a pleasure. How are you today? I'm great, teacher. Okay, very good. Good evening. Good evening. <laughs> it's a pleasure to listen and to watch you, right? <laughs> okay, welcome everybody. Watch TV. Watch, you are watching TV. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> One moment, please. Okay, good. <laughs> Look what Rolando has on the wall. A romantic moment. <laughs> okay, good. Welcome, Janari. Welcome, Francisco. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. It's good evening, teacher. Thank good you. Good evening, Francisco. How are you? I am very good, teacher. Okay, very good. Happy to listen to you, right? Eh, las últimas sesiones no se había conectado, Francisco. Yes, teacher. Okay. I was very busy. I understand. Don't worry, Francisco, but you're here. It's the Thank important you. thing. Okay, good. Now, uh, we, eh, Rolando, we are watching the picture you or the drawing you have back on the wall. Very, very romantic. It's este amo, right? <laughs> ah, <laughs> nice. <laughs> Dun, 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 dun. Congratulations, yes. <laughs> okay, now let's begin. Let's just start with the presentation of today, right? Remember that um, we have to finish the section four this week, right? Section four. Now, sure. Yes, no. tell me, tell me. Tell me, Rolando. No, solo está. Estaba leyendo un comentario de un compañero que se acaba de conectar. Uh -huh. Que dice que, que no se había podido conectar estas dos semanas. Uh -huh. Pero no le vi el nombre por ahí, fíjese. Ah, ok. Uh, bueno, entonces el mensaje es para todos, ¿verdad? Si no se han conectado y no han estado trabajando en la plataforma, eh, ya tienen que haber completado tres secciones de las cinco que tenemos, ¿verdad? Section one, okay. two, three, right? Teacher, good evening. Good evening. Eh, eh, quien puso el comentario en el grupo fue Alejandro. Alejandro, sí. Déjeme ver si aquí lo... Ajá, Alejandro. Pero Alejandro se ha estado conectando. Yes. Sí, sí. Se ha estado conectando con nosotros. No sé, Alejandro Mansor. Uh -huh. Sí, eh, no sé. Bueno... No, ahorita no está ahorita eh, con nosotros, ¿verdad? No, no está. Solo en WhatsApp. No, está. Solo en WhatsApp, sí. sí. Bueno, ya le voy a escribir a ver si, si tiene problemas de conexión, ¿verdad? Eh, solo déjeme un segundito. Um... Um, hola. Hello, Roberto. Hello, welcome, Roberto. Eh, thanks, teacher. Um, yo escribí el día de ahora en el grupo porque... Ah, ok. Sí, sí. Eh, yo soy el que había tenido el problema de que yo no me había fijado, pero al momento de que me inscribieron, me habían metido mal y pues pasé una semana en, en intermedio de dos. Me ah, comuniqué okay. con el corporativo y ellos me, sol me solventaron el problema y ya ahora ya me incorporo acá en preintermedio de dos. Ah, ok. O sea que usted estaba en un nivel más avanzado, Roberto. Sí, sí, correcto. Me habían mandado dos más, tres, <risa> casi tres más adelante. Y yo Pero, por eso sentía que no, o sea, como que no lograba seguir el ritmo de la clase. Estaba muy difícil. <risa> ah, sí, algo. Bueno, so welcome. Entonces, bienvenido. Welcome to the class. So, here is also difficult, right? Aquí, aquí también algo difícil, but, but it's, <risa> it's not so difficult, right? It's not so difficult. Don't worry. Let me copy your name, Roberto. Roberto Vendaño, right? Yes, teacher. Okay. Okay, good. Now, let's start with the presentation of today, right? Uh, uh, sorry, Roberto, one more thing. Eh, una cosa más, Roberto. Eh, con la plataforma, eh, ¿cómo va? Con la de preintermedio módulo 2. Roberto. Perdón, estaba muteado. Eh, como desde el viernes empecé ya a retomar la, este, la del preintermedio, ¿verdad? Que la comencé. Sí, sí. 
eh, a mediados de la segunda parte voy. Pero eh, sí, o sea, no, lo sí, va avanzando, va avanzando, lo importante. Sí, correcto. Sí. Cualquier, pero cualquier cosa, pues ahí estamos en el, en el grupo de WhatsApp a sus órdenes, ¿verdad? Ah, perfecto. Muchas okay. gracias. Ok, you're welcome. You're welcome. Ok, now let's continue. Pre-intermedia module 2, right? Today we're going to learn about word power appearance. And we're going to learn a conversation. She's very tall, right? So this is the, these are the topics for today, right? Now to start, we're going to listen, uh, we're going to read the lesson objective. Juan Alfonso, can you read the objective for today, please? Juan Alfonso? Okay, so Francisco, help me, please. Okay, teacher. In this session, participants will learn vocabulary for describing people. Today, only vocabulary, 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 right? And we're going to describe people physically and emotionally too, right? Okay, now let's start with the vocabulary. Look, brown, blonde, black, red. This refers to colors, of course, but color of the hair, right? Color of the hair. Now, talking about hair, long, short, like the teacher, right? Short, straight, you know, recto, liso, curly, curly like the teacher. <laughs> okay. Uh, and then a person who, who has no hair, like Bruce Willis, like Toretto, right? Bold, mustache, Bird, beard, no, bird, 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 young, middle age, elderly, young, like, for example, I don't know, Janari, middle age, like the teacher, all right, uh, elderly, is very, very old, right, oh. and Teenager, like Rolando Campos, teenager, okay. right? Okay. Now, uh, appearance, right? Handsome is for men. Good looking is attractive, right? Pretty is for woman. Beautiful woman. Handsome, beautiful men. Good looking is attractive, right? Attractive. Now, short, like the teacher, I'm sure. Fairly short. Fairly short. Medium height, like 170, maybe medium height. Pretty short, very, very short, right? And very short too, right? Now, please, repeat after me. Brown. Brown. If you want, we can uh, turn off the, 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 the microphone. Vamos a apagar los micrófonos, pana. Yes? Okay, thank you, thank you. Now, brown. Blonde, black, red. Uh, sorry, aquí me faltó una E, ¿verdad? Ya lo vamos a corregir. Okay, sorry, continue. Long, short, straight, curly, bold, mustache. Beard, that's the correct pronunciation, beard. Young, yeah, 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 young. Middle age. Elderly. Handsome. Good looking. Pretty. Short, fairly short, medium height, pretty short, very short. Okay, again, I was confused with this pronunciation, but yes, it's beer, right? With D at the end. No beer, right? You know, <laughs> no. It's beer with a D, the, the. Beard, okay? 
Good. Now let's look at the picture and check it out. Look, this is long hair and the color is brown. So long brown hair. Now this guy is short blonde and it's without E, right? Yes, I was, I was wrong. Uh, is without E, it's blonde, yes. Short blonde hair. So in this case, look at the guy, short. Blonde, blonde rubio, you don't say yellow. He has yellow shirt, no, 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 no. Yellow hair, no. Blonde, right? Straight, straight black hair. Curly, red hair. Ball, the mustache and the beard, right? Okay. If you can add more to the hair, uh, eyebrow, eyelashes, right? Now age, young, middle-aged, elderly. Appearance for attractive, handsome, good-looking, pretty. Now height, this is hair, age, and height. Short, fairly short, medium height, tall or pretty tall, right? And very, very tall, right? Like some basketball player, right? Now, do you have any question about this? Questions about uh, appearance? Teacher, ¿cómo sería yes. canoso? White hair, white hair. So in, in the <laughs> Uh, there are two ways, right? Uh, some people got gray, you know, grease, gray, right? And some other people totally white, totally white. So you, you say white hair and gray hair. Mm -hmm. Understand? Thanks. Okay, Teacher. welcome. Now, any other question? Teacher, good evening. Uh, good evening. Uh, hi, uh, what is the meaning fairly short? Fairly is that is not very, uh, very, very short, right? So this is más o menos, like, más o menos, chaparro. Like <laughs> Sorry? Uh, like medium, no. No, no, medium is medium height, you know, like. Ah, okay. okay. Uh -huh. And fairly short is short, but not very, very short, right? Ah, okay. For example, sure. you know about Star Wars, Yoda, for example, Yoda, it very, it's very short, right? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Teacher, yes, eso okay. sería como est estatura promedio. Medium height, yes, medium height. Medium height. For example, in El Salvador, it's considered that one, one meter 65 is medium height, right? And for women, one meter 60. So it's considered, you know, medium. But in United States, it's more, right, you know? And, 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 and fairly means más o menos uh, chaparro, más o menos bajito, right? And pretty tall means that is, the person is tall, right? And very, very tall, you know, it's like basketball players in the United States that they, 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 they are like one meter 90, one meter 95. In some cases, two meters, right? Ooh, right? Very tall, okay? So, but the girl here in green, she's medium height, you know? Medium. Okay, any other question? Now, other words or expressions? Other words or expression? Look, ugly, that is, you know, feito. <laughs> wavy hair, that is ondulado, ondulado, wavy. And uh, when you talk about the colors, sometimes, you know, people have very, Eh, pelo bien negrito, right? Bien negrito, right? And, and, and some people that have, you know, not very dark, you know, no, no muy negrito, algo ni tan negrito, pero, you know, poquito. Or, or like you say, light, light black, for example, right? And then in this case, you say, for example, dark brown hair, it says café oscuro, right? Light brown hair is Café claro, right? Then say happen with red, for example, right? Uh, dark red hair. It's like pelo rojo, bien, bien rojito, ¿verdad? No como los colores que se pintan ahora, que bien <laughs> rojo, verde y morado. Right? 
que parecen algodón de azúcar. No. Eh, this is natural, right? Or it could be light red hair, right? Good. And you were asking me about um, the hair, right? So we have gray hair, pelo gris, que en este caso sería lo mismo que light, light black, right? It's the same, right? And white, blanquito totalmente, right? Que el teacher ya va para ese camino. <laughs> okay. White hair. Now we have other adjectives. Cute is uh, for babies. Bonito, right? It's cute. It's like, you know, beautiful. And for, you can use cute for all people. You can say uh, the boy is cute, the girl is cute. Is attractive. Cute is also attractive, right? And old, you know, it's like elderly old, right? Fat is, you know, gordito. Or, well, this is offensive in English, also in Spanish, right? To say, eh, gordo, gorda, hmm? come on. You can kill a woman if you say you're gorda. Ah, goodbye. <laughs> be careful, be careful. Never say that, right? <laughs> okay. And, and I, will, I will tell you this, right? When, when your wife asks you, uh, my love, am I fat? In, 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 instantly, you don't see and instantly, immediately you say, no, <laughs> no, right? Don't think, don't say, mm, oh, sorry, regation, right? So you say, <laughs> you say, mm, ah, goodbye. You sleep on the sofa forever. <laughs> You, when the woman say, uh, 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 my honey, am I fat? No, never. No, you're not. Okay, <laughs> good. But other word to say, uh, it's not offensive, right? Uh, heavy. In English, for example, fat is offensive. Heavy is not offensive, right? It's like you say, uh, gordo, and the other one heavy is uh, gordito, pesadito, <laughs> you know? Okay, and then we have the color of the eye, green eyes. Brown eyes, blue eyes, black eyes, right? In the case of the teacher, right, uh, green eyes. Okay, thank you. Now I'm, I'm, I'm wearing my, my, my contact lenses, right? Es que ando usando los lentes de contacto y son café, pero lo, los originales son verdes, yes. <laughs> okay, oh. now, slim, that is uh, delgado, right? Peche, like we say in El Salvador, thin at the same rate, slim and thin, synonyms, synonyms, right? And skinny is ooh, very, very, extremely slim, uh, thin, right? You know, skinny is like, like we say in El Salvador, very peche, right? <laughs> okay, and muscular, <clears throat> muscular, right? <laughs> okay, so these are other words that you use to describe people, right? Good. Now repeat after me, please. Ugly. Wavy hair. Cute. Gray hair. Dark brown hair. Light brown hair. Old. White hair. Fat. Heavy, green eyes, brown eyes, blue eyes, black eyes. Don't say A's, right? A's. <laughs> eyes, 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 yes. Slim, thin, skinny. Muscular, muscular. Okay, I want to tell you something about thin. You know, when you go to the hardware, cuando vamos a la ferretería you, uh, and you are painting, you know, you're painting your house, you say, ay, me da un bote de thinner. Me da un bote de thinner, but it's not thinner. It's thinner, thinner, al, adelgazador, right? You know, adelgazador. That's you say, it's thinner, right? Okay. For example, Look, Teacher, I y cuando se refiere al color de la piel. Ah, eh, black, black eh, skin. 
teacher, white, pero white black, skin. Teacher, But it's offensive. Black, I know it's offensive. Okay, okay. Of niga, okay. niga, niga. No, of course, but no. That, that, <laughs> I mean, if you're, ni if you're niga and the other is niga, no problem, right? But a white person that tells a negro that is a niga <laughs> is very offensive, right? Entre ellos sí se pueden decir así, right? Okay? But uh, uh, if you other person say that, it's offensive. Also, uh, you have tan skin. Tan skin is uh, piel bronceada. Tan. T-A-N, right? Tan skin. Or brunette. You, you tell someone, you're, you have, you're brunette. It's like, eres moreno. Like most Latin people, right? We are, we are not cheles, right? <laughs> we are not white, totally white. We are uh, brunette or, or tan skin, right? Tenemos piel morena. And the other color, for example, Chinese people is uh, yellow. They say yellow, but also it's offensive. You say, you are yellow, you have yellow skin, it's offensive, right? So never say black skin, but physically, of course, you can say that, but culturally, no, it's offensive, right? Okay, good, any other question? And also, when you have ear, right, you describe the ear, you say big ears, <laughs> small ears, or they have grande, <laughs> like Mickey Mouse, right? <laughs> or, or green, I mean, a small, small ear, right? It's... Okay, but I want to explain this. Look, thinner, right? Thinner, thinner or is the word, right? It's adelgazador. But in Spanish, we say thinner, but it's not thinner, right? It's thinner. Thinner, right? Adelgazador. Okay, now let's continue with the presentation. Okay. Ah, the conversation, please. Uh, Roberto, can you read the, the objective for this session, please? Uh, lesson, lesson objective. In this session, participants will listen to a conversation between two people describe uh, another person. Adjectives uh, of appearance will be pra practice. Practice. Mm -hmm. practice. practice. Thank you. Thank you. That's okay. Thank you, Robert. Describing. So descriptions. Description, right? Okay. Very good. Now, in this conversation, the vocabulary we're going to practice is girlfriend. Gorgeous, look like, suppose. Repeat after me, please. Girlfriend. Gorgeous. Look like. Suppose. So any question? Um, this is your, uh, what is suppose? Supposition. I oh. suppose, I imagine, I imagine, I suppose, I bet. It's a supposition, right? Oh, I suppose. Teacher. Okay, I suppose this teacher is El Tunco, right? El Tunco Beach. <laughs> I suppose, I imagine. <laughs> Good. Now, another teacher. question. Yes? Jo Georges. Gorgeous. Glamoroso, Gorgeous. glamoroso, elegante. Eh, what is the word in Spanish? Despampanante. <laughs> Gorgeous, right? Like, you, you know, it's like, like uh, Blancanieves, for example, Snow White. With her dress, you know, she was gorgeous. Okay? And there is a song. The name of the song is Lady in Red. La Dama de Rojo, Lady in Red. So in one part of the lyrics, they say, gorgeous, you were gorgeous. La chica de rojo se miraba glamorosa, right? Gorgeous. Okay, good. Any other question? Can you share? Yes, tell me, Rolando. Es lo mismo maravillosa, sí. Well, uh, no, I, wonderful is more like... Um, Yeah, it could be, it could be physical, but it's more like, like pers it's related more like personality, right? Right? Yes. yes, you can say you look wonderful. Yes, you can say that. But uh, you can also use wonderful for, for uh, personality, right? 
But gorgeous is exclusive appearance, no personality, right? Understand? Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, now yes. let's continue. Sorry, any question? Yes, I'm amazing. No. Amazing, uh -huh, it's a synonym. But amazing also is not, um, it could be, of course, it's positive, right? But uh, uh, you can describe situations. For example, um, this idea, my idea is amazing, right? Uh, or or uh, place. Uh, the places are amazing. Uh -huh. uh, the, for example, the beach, uh, El okay. Tunco Beach. El Tunco Beach is amazing, right? Oh. Amazing. <laughs> Okay. Uh -huh. But but when you say gorgeous is exclusive for for physical appearance and for people. For people. Uh -huh. You cannot say oh. the, the beach is gorgeous. <laughs> no, you cannot say that, right? Oh, my dog is gorgeous. <laughs> no. No. Only for people, right? Cheese mm -hmm. or he? Mm, more like she. <laughs> yes, she. because. <laughs> Because I don't know, sure. I, I don't imagine a man like glamoroso, you know, like a grandma. No, no, I, I think, right? I imagine, I imagine only Juan Gabriel was gorgeous only, right? <laughs> only, but I don't know, but okay. it's, it's more like for women, you know, for women. I, I, okay. I suppose, right? Okay, good. Now, let's go to the conversation, please. Listen, Emily says, I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. And Randy says, yes, her name is Ashley and she's gorgeous. I understand, gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? And this means, como se ve ella, right? So when I say look like, look, look like is, que apariencia tiene, como se ve, right? Physically, no, no, no personality, physically, look like, right? She's very tall. How tall? About six feet two. I don't know how much is this, but I suppose it's one meter eighty. I suppose this is right. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? She has a beautiful. She has beautiful red hair. And how old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Yes, it's another secret. Uh, boys, it's another secret. Never ask the age a woman, right? Never, please. Okay, now, I'm giving you some clues, right? Estoy dando muchas claves ahí. <laughs> Good, now, please, repeat after me. I hear you have a new girlfriend, Randy. Yes. Her name's Ashley. And she's gorgeous. Really? What does she look like? What does she look like? What does she look like? She is very tall. How tall? About six feet two, I suppose. Wow, that is tall. What color is her hair? Hair. Don't say hair. No, no. Hair. What color is her hair? She has beautiful red hair. How old is she? I don't know. She won't tell me. Okay. So you can see the picture here, right? You can see the picture of the woman that she's very tall, right? I remember a son of Menudo, right? I don't know if, uh, if you remember the group Menudo, the musical group Menudo, that uh, there is a song that says, Ella es más alta que yo. Ella es más... And then it says, Se tardó dos horas en ponerse de pie. <laughs> Come on, because she's very tall, right? 
Imagine, right? Y dice, era tan alta que cuando se caía, caía, caía el día siguiente, you know? <laughs> Very tall, right? You can imagine the person, right? And she's gorgeous too. Good. Any question about vocabulary here in the conversation? Any question? Okay, so uh, we are going to practice, right? We are going to practice with the, with the vocabulary that I sent to the group. Give me a second here. Uh, and I will make three groups, three groups, right? What are we going to do? Uh, if you don't have the paper, if you didn't print, right? Si no imprimimos el material, eh, ahí está en el grupo, en el grupo de WhatsApp, right? So, I will make the groups, voy a hacer los grupos, tres grupos, y se van al WhatsApp, al grupo de WhatsApp, y ahí está la, la hojita, right? And we're going to make this, right? Uh, ooh. Eh, Morena, right? Eh, Morena, entonces, eh, me le ayuda a los compañeros, este, se va a San Google, nos vamos todos a San Google <ríe> y ahí nos auxiliamos, ¿verdad? Ok, listen, eh, the, it's, a, it's a sheet, right? Es una hojita, it's a sheet and eh, there are three columns, hay tres columnas. Excellent, Brenda, thank you, thank you very much. El que esté con Brenda se la va a calar porque ella tiene la, la, la hojita ahí, ¿verdad? <ríe> ok, good. Eh, Teacher, yo también lo anoté en el cuaderno todo el Excellent, vocabulario. my goodness Thank you, Silvia Very good, smart, smart <laughs> Good eh, And then uh, You're going to listen You're going to translate into Spanish Me van a trasladar al español Las columnas, right? So we're going to make like this Group number one The first column, right? El grupo número uno me va a traducir la primera columna Right? Group number two, the second column, la, la columna dos. And group number three, the column number three, la columna número tres, right? And we're going to make it like this, right? Uh, everybody's looking for some words, right? And a secretary, one secretary is copying the meaning, right? One secretary is copying the meaning. Una secretaria o secretario <laughs> eh, va a copiar el significado de las palabras, right? Understand? And later we're going to meet, vamos a unir, right? And then we're going to tell all the meaning, right? Of all the words. Understand? Okay. Yes, sir. Sure. Good. Now, as, as I repeat, if you cannot check it, right? Si no pueden chequearlo, eh, en el caso de Morena, pues, eh, tiene problemitas ahí con lo de la batería, entonces, que le ayuden los demás compañeros. Y si no lo imprimieron, pues, ahí está en el grupo de WhatsApp. Yes? Okay. Now, We're going to, to make groups. Nos vamos a ir a los grupos. Okay, let me see. Three group, right? Okay, group number one. Attention, please. Group number one. Ana Maria, Brenda, Claudia Castro, Claudia Ramos, Mayra Asnitia, Rosa Suyapa, and Yanari. Excellent. Solo pesos pesados aquí. No, group number two, Adonai Portillo, Juan Alfonso, Roberto, Silvia Roxana, usuario de Zoom, que no me he puesto el nombre, solo sé que es una chica, Víctor Martínez. Now, group number two, right? Group number three, Francisco, Josué Ernesto, Lorena, Rodrigo, Rolando, and Vicky. ¿Ok? Uh, I'm me, teacher, maybe in the... Because I in the, 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 the cell phone. Ajá. Uh -huh. eh, usted está Hilda, como. Hilda, Hilda Alvarado. Hilda, usted está como usuario de Zoom, porque solo usuario de Zoom me parece. Yes. Ah, yes, vaya, yes. entonces Hilda. I'm sorry, okay. Hilda. Perdón, que sí. como no la veo en el video, ¿verdad? Solo. Yes. Solo su vocecita ahí identifico, ¿verdad? <ríe> que ya es familiar. Ok. Ok. Entonces va con el grupo 2, Hilda. Ok. Ok. So again. Grupo número uno, el grupo número uno, la columna uno. Grupo dos, columna dos, en grupo tres, columna tres. Right? Ready? Here we go.
Hello, hello. Eso sería, ¿verdad? Yes. Entonces nos toca la columna número uno. Number one. Ahí, ahí está. He, he llenado las primeras cinco. Hello, hello. Pueden usar el Google. Hello. hello. You can use Google, right? San Google. <laughs> no problem. Okay. Okay. Enojado. Yes. Enojado. En catch invaded, right? <laughs> Angry. Okay. Yes. But one secretary. Si quieren, eh, ustedes van averiguando y solo uno vaya copiándolo para que vean rápido. Yes. Okay. Okay. Continue, continue. Yo voy a ocupar. Compañera, okay. yo tengo las primeras cinco. No sé si. de cada una, depende de lo que nos toque y después unirlo exacto hello, hello hello teacher it's permitted to hello, use teacher. Google, right? it's permitted, está permitido usar San Google, así es que ok hey, teacher, okay. Okay, teacher name, a, name a secretary, <laughs> nombre a un secretario para que sea más fácil, solo ustedes <laughs> le van dictando ok el dict teacher, es que lo yes. que hemos hecho ahorita es compartirnos este, cinco oraciones cada uno, cinco oh. palabras cada ah, uno. Ah, excelente. Y después las vamos a unir para terminarlo más rápido. ¡Cling! Excelente. Sigan entonces. Después me uno a ustedes. <ríe> ok. Ok. Sucio. Sucio. Eh, please, no me estén ofendiendo. ¿Qué pasa ahí? Yo solo estoy. No, teacher. ¿Qué pasa? No, teacher. Ah, vaya. Vaya. Relaxing. Play. ¿O quién, ¿Quién es el secretario en este grupo? ¿Quién es el secretario? No, teacher, es que nadie, nadie, ah, sí. na, nadie de nosotros. Nadie de nosotros la imprimió. Nadie. Entonces, pero ahí está. No, en, pero ahí está en el grupo de, de WhatsApp. Pueden. Pueden intercambiar ahí. Solo sí. Sí es. O, o quieren sí. que se los comparta un ratito, por lo menos. No, aquí lo sí. por, Ahí está. Ah, va, está bien. No hay sí. problema. Entonces, vayan, si quieren, distribuyanse las palabras. Uh -huh. Ustedes tienen la columna 3. Por ejemplo, sí. pueden sí. poner 7 cada uno. Quiero ver. Eh, your ¿Cuántas three? son, Ticha? 7, right. Son 7 ustedes. Déjenme ver. 7, 4. De seis a siete les tocan por lo menos. ¿Ok? Entonces distribuyansela okay. y rapidito las copian y... ¿Verdad? Por ejemplo, Rolando podría ponerse de, de clever hasta no, naughty, naughty. Que quiere decir eh, pica. Travieso, ¿verdad? Travieso. <risa> yes. Pero hasta ahí ya las tenemos, creo yo. Ah, va. Entonces síganle, síganle. Uh -huh. Yo lo estoy dando sugerencias. Ustedes trabajen como puedan mejor. Okay. Teacher, ya teacher, yes, 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 ¿Cuántas ¿Mm? son de la columna 3? Ahorita le digo. Eh... Son unas 30. Yes. Ahorita le digo. 25. 29. 29 son. 29. Yes. 29. Ok, ahorita, ahorita las distribuimos. Oh, excuse me, matemática. No, no, no. no. <laughs> ok, good. Do it, do it, do it. De
Yo estaba buscando el significado de punk y dice que tiene un significado despectivo y que significa basura, suciedad. Uy. No sé si se refiere a personas. Significa... Eh, ponga, pónganlo como vándalo, vándalo. Ah, vándalo. Okay. Es que es, es un movimiento que salió en 1970 como despectivo. Ajá, ah, como que se vestían mal, se ponían el pelo así. Ajá, los pelos parados. Ajá, correcto. Entonces póngalo como vándalo. Vándalo. Le, le mandé al grupo lo que ya habíamos traducido. Ah, ok. Sí, yo estoy bien. bien. Gracias. Bueno. Any question? ¿Alguna pregunta? ¿Todo bien? Eh, de silly. Silly. Es, es tonto. O sea, es que hay varias palabras como dumb, eh, stupid, uh, silly. Y weak. Uh, quiere decir no débil. Vez, hombre. Débil. Débil, right? Physical, right? Débil. Ok. Good. Ok. Good. Continue, okay. continue, continue. ¿Verdad? Ahí la regamos porque nosotros ya agarramos las, las de él. Si gustan ustedes, ya solo hagan. Ay, Dios mío, es que aquí ya no No, ni importa el... ahorita. Hay que, hay que Avancemos, hay que Lila. Ajá, de sí. todos modos, ahí nos vamos a ir viendo cuál. A la hora. Ya tengo las mías, ya. Vaya, ah. si gustan, regálenmela. Para, para escribirlas. Yo tengo, ya le digo. Tengo desde de tired. Ajá, digan. Cansado. Guay. Amplio. Ajá. Expensive. Amplio. Sí. Ajá. Expensive, costoso. Empty. Ajá. Vacío. Y fancy, lujosa. Ok. Lujo, lujoso o elegante, fancy. ¿eh? Exacto. Ah, okay. Yo ya tengo las mías también, Silvia. Vale, regálemelas. Vale, yo comienzo con. La noche, Stranger. Está bien. Entonces. Solo en Tini Tini es lo que le decía que bien rara que sale. Vea si la vea si la hay alguien ahí. Tini. Tal vez alguien le sale otra cosa. Tiny quiere decir pequeñito. Tiny. Ah, ah, ¿Te acuerdan de los? Oyendo el teacher. ¿Te acuerdan de los Tiny Toons? Tiny Toons. Ajá. Ah, ah, pequeñitos. Okay. Sí, teacher. Tiny pequeñito quiere decir ya. Yes. Ok. Eh, ok. Moment, okay. Please. Moment, please. Uh, Moment, please. ¿Usted las anotó? Sí, me dieron una lección aquí ahorita. Ok. Se la, se la, voy, a leer, se la voy a leer en inglés y usted la, la dice en español. Vaya, ¿qué yo? Oh. Dele. Hola. Vaya, dele. Ok. Cleaver. Inteligente. Cute. Lindo. Matt. Met. Enojado. Married. Casado. Missy. Sucio. Neat. Ordenado. Naughty. Naughty. Travieso. Nosy. Curioso. Noisy. Ruidoso. Nice. Agradable. Nut. Nueces. Platicador. Uh -huh. Tini. Pe Tiny Tun, pequeñito. <risa> Solo un Yusufo. comentario, perdón, que lo interrumpa. Yes, teacher. Nuts quiere decir semillas, o, ¿verdad? Pero uh -huh. not. Para, cuando usted le dice a alguien, you're nuts, quiere decir que estás loco. 
You're oh. Not... Oh. Oh, oh, de verdad. Loco o atrevido, ¿verdad? You have nuts. Tener la, las agallas, tener la fuerza para tirarte. Ah. Del... You know, estás loco, you ¿no? Know? <risa> ¿Y, y, y, si ¿Y si le dice crazy? También, pero crazy es más general. Nuts es algo así como que es bien aventado para todo. You're not. Direct, pero ahí depende en la oración, teacher. Sí, depende, pero ustedes pónganle loco. Mm, va. Okay. Okay. Doblemente okay. crazy. Va. Yes. Me salí, teacher. Sorry. Ah, okay. No problem. Ya lo vamos a hacer juntos. No se preocupe. Ok. Don't worry. Ya solo tenemos 30 segundos para los demás grupos. Lo vamos a hacer todos juntos. Right? Sorry. ¿Me puede regresar al grupo un momento? <ríe> no, lo vamos a hacer todos juntos porque ya casi se nos acaba, <ríe> se nos acaba el tiempo. Ah, ok. Sí. Ok. okay. Teacher. Okay, teacher, ya, ya salgo con mi nombre, ¿verdad, teacher? Sí, Hilda Alvarado. Ay, sí, es a ver. Hilda Alvarado de la O. <laughs> no, <I'm> kidding. <laughs> okay, good. Let's do it together, right? Group number one, ready? I will tell you in English and the pronunciation and you tell me in Spanish, right? Group number one, ready? Yes, ya todos ready. Regres ya regresamos todos, quiero ver. Yes, ya estamos todos, ¿verdad? Okay, good. Ready and the rest copy, right? Los demás vayan copiando también. Please, ready? Okay, angry. Enojado. Enojado. Awful. Horrible. Horrible, odioso. También odioso. Un... Goof, goofy. Mentecato, disparatado. Mentecato, tonto, right? Eh, en el salvo va a ser eh, pasmado, dundo. <risa> <Yeah>. <risa> Ok, handsome, handsome, guapo, guapo, Hap, happy, feliz, hard, feliz. hard, difícil, difícil, heavy, pesado, hot, caliente, huge, enorme, enorme, humble, humilde, humilde. silly, tonto, tonto, ok, small, pequeño, pequeño. stubborn, <coughs> Obstinado. Obstinado. Obstinado, necio, burro. Right? Ok. Yes. Ugly. Ugly. Feo. Feo. Weak. Débil. Débil. Big. Grande. Beautiful. Hermoso. Boring. Aburrido. Aburrido. Aburrido, pero yo soy el que aburro, ¿verdad? Yo soy el que causo el aburrimiento. Bored. No. Cansado. Pero, Aburrido también o cansado, pero a mí me están aburriendo, ¿verdad? Ok. Boring es el que aburre y bored bore es el que aburrido, ok. Now, busy. Ocupado. Old. Viejo. Viejo. Picky. Quisquilloso. Plain. 
Sencillo. Difícil. Sencillo, Sencillo, plano, no romántico, simple, you know, plain. Polite, oh. polite. Amable. Amable, político, pero los políticos son polite, ¿no? Ok, oh. poor. Pobre, pobre. Pretty. Bonito. Bonito. Proud. Orgulloso. Orgulloso en sentido positivo, ¿verdad? Sentido positivo, proud. Punk. Vándalo. Vándalo, ok. Quiet. Tranquilo. Tranquilo, ok. Group number two, ready? Insane. Insane. Group two. Insano. Insano, loco. Desquiciado, right? Insane. Kind. Kind. Tipo. Tipo. Amable. Amable. Uh -huh. Amable. Ok, large. Grande. Grande. Lazy. Perezoso. Perezoso. Long. Largo. Largo. Lovely. Encantadora. Encantadora, adorable, right? Loud. Cuidoso. Cuidoso. Low. Bajo. 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 Little. Little. Pequeño. Pequeño. Sick. Enfermo. 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 Oh. Starving. Hambriento. Hambriento. Stuffy. Cargado. Cargado, incómodo, ¿verdad? Cuando uno se siente incómodo, stuff, right? Ok, thirsty. Sediento. Sediento. Upset. Trastornado. Trastornado, enojado, molesto, ¿verdad? Molesto, upset. Ok, wealthy. Rico. Rico. Rico, Rico de dinero. De dinero. <ríe> ok, cocky. Engreído. 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 Right? Corny. Cursi. 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 Cursi, right? Cheater. Tramposo. Tramposo. Tramposo, engañador, ¿verdad? El que anda con dos novias, el que se roba las uvas en el súper, o el que copia en el examen, el que copia en los exámenes, ese es cheater, right? Cheater. Sí. Ok, eh, continuo, please. Chip. Barato. 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 Shovey. Gordito. Gordito. Gordito, rellenito. Rich. Rico. Rico. Rico de dinero también, ¿verdad? También puede ser de comida, sí. ambos, ambos. Rude. Grosero. Grosero. Grosero, rudo, right? Square. Cuadrado. Cuadrado, que no sale de ahí, ¿verdad? Cuadrado. Mucha gente así. Now, tall. Alto. 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 Tire. Cansado. Wide. Amplio. Amplio, Amplio ancho. Expensive. Costoso. 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 Empty. Vacío. Fancy. Lujoso o elegante. Elegante, very good. Fancy restaurant, un restaurante caro. ¿eh? Clever. Inteligente. Group number three, right? Inteligente, listo, buzo, buzo, clever, right? Okay, cute. Lindo. Lindo, bonito, chulo, right? Mad. Ay. Enojado. Enojado puede ser también loco. Mad, you're mad. Estás loco, mad. Okay, now, married. Casado. Casado. ¿Cómo? Suicidado, what's that? <laughs> okay, Messi. Sucio. Sucio, desordenado, sucio, ah, Messi. Neat. Okay. Lo opuesto, ah, neat. Ordenado. Ordenado, nítido, nítido, right? Ordenado, ajá. Naughty. Okay. Naughty. Travieso. Travieso, pícaro, ¿verdad? En, le da doble sentido a las cosas, Naughty. Ok. Nosy. Curioso. Curioso, metiche, como Snoopy. Snoopy es metidito. Snoopy. ¿Ok? El, no, el, el perrito. No. El, ok, no. Snoopy. Snoopy metido. quiere decir metido, metidito. Oh. Ok. No, Ahorita sí. lo voto. <risa> no, es my favorite. <risa> no, es my favorite. No, es sí. Ruidoso. Nice. Ruidoso. Nice. Agradable, right? Agradable. Nuts. Loco, Nuts. loco. Loco, atrevido, ¿verdad? Single. Cantante. Soltero. No, singer, right? Singer es cantante, mm. ¿no? Single es soltero. Soltero, right? Sencillo. Soltero. soltero. Smart. Lo que todos quieren. Está <risa> soltero. Yes. Inteligente. Inteligente. Smart. ¿Cómo se llama el, el supermercado? Price Smart, ¿verdad? Precios inteligentes. Price Smart. Ok, now, talkative. Price Smart. Talkative. Platicador o hablador. 
Rolando, por favor, no esté hablando mal de las chicas. O sea, por favor, respetemos. <risa> Tócate. <risa> Tiny. Pequeñito. Pequeñito. Uh, useful. Útil. Útil, right. Worried. Worried. Preocupado. 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 Como dice en San Miguel, ¿verdad? Culillo, dice en San Miguel. Ok. Culillo. Dumb. <coughs> Tonto. Tonto. Eh, hay una película que se llama eh, Una pareja de idiotas. Dumb and dumb. Tonto y redondo. Ajá, Dumb and Dumb. Tonto y retonto. Ajá, Dangerous. Peligroso. Peligroso. No me estén hablando mal de la campanera, por favor. Ok. <risa> Dirty. <risa> Dirty. <risa> Sucio de, de suciedad, right? Fat. Gordo. Gordito. Fishy. Gordito. Fishy. Sospechoso. Sospechoso, es como el pescado. Este huele mal, algo, algo huele mal ahí, ¿no? Fishy. Eh, sospechoso. Slim. Delgado. Delgado, delgado, delgadito. Funny. Divertido. Sad. Triste. Short. Corto o bajo. Yeah. Ah, correct. Eh, young. Joven. Strong. Fuerte. Repeat, please, repeat. Fuerte. Re Thank you. Stronger. <laughs> fuerte, fuerte. Okay, sad, sad. Triste. Triste, right? Okay, I am sad because we finished the class. Me siento triste yes. que terminamos la clase, así que eh, les quedo viendo see you video, tomorrow. los videos para mañana. Mañana los practicamos, okay? See you tomorrow. Okay, teacher. 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 See you tomorrow, teacher. Good job. Congratulations. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.